Hey, what's up, Journey Gang? Thank you so much for tuning back into the channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Life. On this channel, we bridge the gap between neuroscience and spirituality. We focus on how the mind works so we can create our own reality. Now, if that sounds like you'll get down, then you're in the right place. Hang out a while. Subscribe if you feel in the vibe. And then, of course, feel free to hit the like button, comment, share any videos that resonate with you. In today's video, we are going to talk about how you shouldn't let the bad days fool you. But before we do that, I do want to mention that we now have memberships opened up on the channel. So if you are wanting to join the membership and support the channel in that way, feel free to do that. If you're not interested in it, no big deal. It's all good. I appreciate you guys being here and watching the channel. We also have the Fab Five giveaway. So just by watching, engaging in the channel, sharing the content, you are putting yourself in a position where you could get $500 a month. If you haven't heard about that, just to sum it up real quick, once this channel gets to making $5,000 a month in ad revenue, I'm going to start giving away $500 a month. So what we're doing is between now and that time, I'm building Building a list of 500 names that I will randomly pick from every month to give away that $500. So just by being a watcher of the channel, a sharer, a liker, you know, a person who is active on the channel, you have a chance to be in that giveaway. Okay, so that's going to be a lot of fun. But if you want to support the channel monetarily as well, that does add to the $5,000 a month that helps us get there. So super exciting stuff lots of stuff in the works guys i am working on some stuff i'm in the lab i'm working on stuff that we're going to be launching uh, as different playlists and different things we're going to be doing on the channel so i'm not going to go too much into that because i'll be over promising and under delivering sometimes so we're not going to go into that we just don't do it right so in today's video i want to just remind you guys not to let the bad days fool you what happens is sometimes it's easy to be pulled back into a negative Nancy type of vibe. It's easy to get pulled back into depression if that's where you come from, anxiety if that's where you're coming from. It's really, really easy to get pulled back into that, okay? So I want to make sure you know that if you are on this journey, progress is progress. If you're seeing a positive result from the things that you are doing, if you're meditating, you're working out, you're eating healthy, you're keeping your heart and mind in a positive place because you want to attract positive things into your life. If you end up having some bad days, don't let those bad days fool you. Don't let those bad days pull you back into that depression or pull you back into that anxiety. You know, those bad days, they come around and then you're like, see, I knew it. I knew it was too good to be true. No, you're just having a bad day. And if you have a bad day, it can it can be so easy to let it fool you and to think that, okay, life is back to being what it was. Life is going back in, in that direction again. But the thing is, you don't have to allow that bad day to take over right? Because you're building momentum in having that high vibe, being happy, you know, Abraham Hicks reference, caring about how you feel, right? You care more about how you feel than you do anything else. And so you're not willing to let those bad days become bad weeks and become bad months. Because that's what can easily happen if you allow that bad day to fool you into thinking that, oh, now it has to be a bad day. Now tomorrow has to be bad. Next week has to be bad because today is bad. That's what happens a lot when you are on this type of journey, especially if you're in the beginning of the journey. Most of us who are already adapt to feeling good, we can have a bad day. We know that that bad day will pass. So this is kind of like a part two to the last video. Like let it let it be there, but let it pass. Don't let that bad day overcome you. Don't let that bad day guide the rest of your day. Don't let that bad day guide the rest of your week, right? Don't let it change how you feel. Try not to. Like if it does, let it go ahead and play itself out for that time, but expect to feel better. Keep reaching for better. That's what I do when I'm feeling bad or I'm just having a bad day. I'm feeling down. Even if I'm like feeling physically, which I haven't gotten sick in a while, but even if I'm physically sick, I'll tell myself I feel better. I feel great. I feel excited. I feel fresh. I, I'm thriving. Like I just convinced myself. So if you're having that bad day, if it's mentally, physically, whatever it is, I want you to convince yourself. I want you to 
talk to yourself. Talk to yourself like you would talk to a friend. If you saw your friend was depressed, your friend have feeling anxiety right now, feeling down, feeling depressed, what would you say to that friend? Do that same thing for yourself. You're the only person that can really convince you of these things. You are the person that matters. Your opinion is the only one that matters. We've talked about that so many times. So tell yourself that you're feeling good. Tell yourself this too shall pass. Tell yourself, expect that tomorrow is going to be a better day. Don't let the bad days fool you. This was just a quick video just to motivate you guys and let you know that this too shall pass and you are the one in full control of that. You are the one that is creating your reality and it's okay to have a bad day. Thank you guys for watching this video all the way to the end. I love you all for no reason at all. I'll see you next time.